Hey guys, welcome back. So I came back here to do this. I went out and I, I gathered some bees and stuff and then, you know, got everything ready at the house. I got full iron and iron tools. Um, I actually just found some sugar canes over there. And I came up on this hill to get a nice view of the thing that we're going to be conquering. I noticed that there's a, a great wood tree over here that has a chest underneath it. So I'm just going to run over real quick and grab that before I head in there because who knows if there's something incredibly valuable in this that is going to end up saving our butts. So, I'm just gonna light it up a little bit. Hopefully it'll be on one of the... Nope, not on this side. Here? Nope. It's under there. Okay, well we don't need a cave spider spawning. So, I don't mind breaking that. Steel leggings? Nice. Blast protection 4. Holy cow. A thomium axe? It's better than iron axe. Okay, well then. That went well. Um... I'm going to put these on because they don't give more protection, but they last longer. So I figure that's, you know, something, I guess. Alrighty. So let's head back over here. And is this a deep cave, too? It's probably connected to that one, but... Oh, no. It's just some some letting glitch with a little, little pond. Okay. So now hopefully... Like, what I'm hoping for this is that we'll just run in, light it all up, and we'll be all set. And, um, hopefully, at some point, uh, we'll have a use for the, the node here. Though I'm not really sure. Okay, just hop on in, throw down torches, and there you go. <laughs> well, that was simple. Much easier than I expected it to be. Okay, let's see, we've got a diamond, nice. Some bones, I guess those are kind of cool. Thalmium bread, more sapphires medium biomes page, and some books. Beautiful. Um, I don't think I have any need for the chests, but we'll leave the rest of this stuff here. The spawners and everything. No need to destroy them. We might have use for them later. Um, so, like I may make a, a trap there or something. You know, I was... I didn't think this through. I'm gonna go back and drop this stuff off, and then we'll go down the deep cave. So I'll be back in just a second. Alrighty. So here we are, at the deep cave again. We're There's two deep caves. <laughs> I'm going to go in this one, because it looked deeper. Yeah, that goes way down to lava. <laughs> That's dangerous. Is it marble? <laughs> there's one thing of marble, I guess. Or, well, I guess it's just the corner, because there's more here. Just like a little edge of a marble deposit. Those marble deposits, man, they get crazy. Like, serious crazy. Um, each marble deposit that I've found has like 30, 40 stacks of marble, or, I'm sorry, did I say 30 or 40? I meant like 70 stacks of marble in it. Um, I don't know why I said 30 or 40. I don't know how to count, guys. You should know that by now. Um, so let's grab some of that, because we're going to need some quick silver at some point. I want to go over there, but we need gold, which means we need to go down. And this is not down. Okay. I just thought maybe there would be a, a slight less um, steep path down, but it doesn't appear so. So let's make our way down, slowly. Um, I don't want to fall in some lava and die. Uh, what is this, lead? I think that's lead, yeah. No silver with it, really? That's odd. Usually it comes with silver. Bauxite's going to be useful once we get to phase three. Um, I don't know. I don't think uh, <laughs> I'm ever going to have much of a use for nickelite. I hear a zombie somewhere. Um, I'm just going to have a little walkway there, just in case. Gotta be careful. I don't want to fall into this lava here, obviously. Whew, that was kind of scary. Okay. Make a little path across. Grab some redstone, too. We're going to need that, I suppose, <laughs> for various things. That's definitely a creeper. Hey, creeper. Hey, creeper, buddy. Whoa, there's a spawner. Appears to be a skeleton spawner. Ah, just let me know. Okay. Yep, fight each other. Oh, good. There's another creeper. Okay, and that's lava right there. 
There we go. Now at the very least I don't have to worry about falling in that lava. Yep. Okay, you guys got that. Just let me hop in here real quick. <laughs> They're taking care of each other, no big deal. Alright. There we go. That was entertaining. Hopefully. <laughs> um, so now we've got a few things. A bucket, some gunpowder. That's cool. Um, hmm. I'm going to make a thing for here. I want to bring the Y down to 10, because I believe that's where my head is. Skelly Spawner 1. Okay. Done. And then I should be able to waypoints, just, yep, disable that. That is creepy looking. That is really creepy looking. Okay. That way I don't have to see it all the time, but I'll, I'll still be able to find it if I need to. Um, because eventually I'm going to have a portal gun, but I'm going to save that until the IC2 phase, because um, it's pretty technology, you know? You know what I mean? It's pretty technology. That's... I'm good. I'm good at words. Can't even say that right. Okay. Anyway. Uh, let's look for gold. Got some more lava. Some more lead. I do want to grab this stuff just because um, I'm probably never going to have any use for forsythium, but or however the poop you say it. Oh, that's, that's bad. Well, you know, I'm just going to fill that in before I manage to fall into it somehow. Yep, that's that's also bad. Okay. Let's go this way. Let's see, what's the... What, why are we at? 13? Okay, so we are at gold level. Oh, well, not anymore. Um, I think... Actually, no, gold, gold spawns higher than uh, diamonds do. So we should be able to find those around. Oh! This a ravine? Yeah, it's a ravine. This ought to help. Um, oh, I should really check the time. Okay. I have no idea how long I've been recording for, but presumably it's been like five minutes? It doesn't seem like too long. Um, so I'm just going to say five minutes. I'm going to try to make these episodes like... The problem with me <laughs> is I want to make long episodes. So I just want to keep... Oh, gold. Um, I just want to keep recording, but I, I just can't do that. <laughs> Um, so I end up making a lot of really short episodes, and then overflowing. Like, I have too many, and I can't upload them. Like, tr trying to upload them once a day isn't enough. So I end up having to upload, like, more than one a day, but I, I stockpile them for a while, thinking, no, it's okay, I'll slow down eventually. And then I just don't, and it gets really bad. And then I just can't possibly upload enough videos to make up the the difference. So I end up with just like 30 videos, and I try to upload them as quickly as I can, and it doesn't work very well. Okay, now I don't know if this counts as, if this thing is counting for my head or my feet. It appears to be for my head. So, at least up to 23 gold is spawning. Uh, which is good, because that means that, you know, there's more, more gold spawning in caves and stuff. Um, gonna make some more torches. Man, my inventory's filling up pretty quick here. Um, we did get gold, and that's what we came for. So let's go back and uh, put that in the furnace. And I believe this is the way back where we came. Yep, there it is. See, that's why you don't just jump into stuff as you're breaking it. There we go. Oh, good, and it's nighttime, too. So we'll have some fun with, like, creepers and stuff when we get back to the house. Or even on our way back to the house. Um... So I don't know if I mentioned it or not, but this house isn't a, a final house. Um, because obviously as things move on, I'm, g I'm probably going to have to move so I can be closer to a node or something. Um, or like find a nice big node so that I can, you know, and move in next to that. Um, and by node I mean aura node for anybody who's not particularly familiar with Thomcraft. So there's that, and then like I'm going to need to get a bigger place once I get to... Um, once I get to uh, buildcraft phase, I'm certainly going to need a bigger house because there's no way... Ooh. Well, you look at that. And I have no space to carry it. I can drop an arrow. Nope, that picked up a cobblestone. Okay. And I want this iron, too. For 
so greedy. Um, but yeah, so, and I'm probably going to at, one, at some point want to make my house out of um, uh, the warded stone blocks um, just to make it safe and make it look cool because they come in a bunch of different colors. So, you know, I'm going to be moving around occasionally, especially when I get between phases. Um, and, oh. Uh, Alright, I can work with that. Nope. Nope. Oh, I guess I only dug my way up. Right, I only dug the staircase up to there. Dude, where are you? Get. See ya. <laughs> he just went right down. Okay, actually, you know what? I do want this cobblestone. Now that I think about it. Um, where did I stop picking it up? A while ago, apparently. Oh, come on. Okay, I'm going back for the cobblestone, just because I don't have all that much. Like, I've been digging out a small area. Um, I think I showed you guys. Maybe I didn't. Maybe that was in the last attempt uh, at recording. I, I did try to record the first episode a couple times, and various things got in the way. Like, for some reason, my voice quality was terrible. So I, was, I, couldn't, I couldn't use it, so I had to get rid of it. And, um, and that was after I had built the house, so that's why you guys didn't see me building the house. Um... That's okay, because I just went over all the stuff while we were caving instead, which worked out pretty well. So let's head back to home, back to our beautiful abode, avoid the angry zombies who are trying to eat my face. That's... what is that? What, what is that over there? Oh, it's desert. Okay. I was thinking that looks kind of like a... the thing that we just did over there, but in the snow place. Hi, Enderman. Okie dokie, avoid the whole thing of skeletons over there. Say hello to the rubber trees. Um, so let's see, now that we've got gold, I can make my wand, which is great. Uh, and we can start researching. I have some... I don't have a lot of paper. So, like, I have gathered some reeds, and I've put them next to my house. But not a whole lot. And they probably haven't really grown. Oh, there's a couple that have grown, but that'll make, like, one thing of paper. Um... So I'm going to have to wait for that a bit, and probably going to want to replant those instead of using them for paper. So uh, I'll bring you guys back in once I've actually um, managed to... Well, not right now. Now we're making a wand. But once I'm done with that, we are going to uh, make our way over there, and I'm going to... What am I saying? I'm going to make some paper, and then I'll bring you guys back in. Okay, because... Because we need paper to do research, and I have, and actually I need to get the materials to do research because I don't have any ink, so I'm gonna need to get some of that. Um, let's see, where do my metals go? Over here. Let's go in there. Let's go in there. Drop all this stuff off. Okay, mob drops go over here. Uh, my buckets, I think, are in here or something. Oh, and I did swap out this bronze helmet on my head and the steel boots on my boots. Um, those were the things that we got from the, the, uh, I don't even know what to call it, the Thumbcraft dungeon thing. Um, so, yeah. Okay, let's drop those in. Um, this is all the cobblestone that I have, so that's why I've been hesitant to use it up. Okay, now that we have this, we can make, actually I'm going to want to make like two wands. Oh good, we have a bunch more fire shots, I'm just going to. Fire shards? Fire shards. <laughs> Alrighty. Um, so let's make two wands. And we're going to come over here and turn that into a workbench. And that way I can have that in there while, I, um, while I've got one to carry around on me. And we need to make a cauldron. And put that down. Okey-dokey, and where's my wand? Ta-da! Okay. Now, let's see. How's the, uh... I don't know how big the aura is in the area here. So, until I make those goggles, this is all I'm going to be able to do. But anyway, um... So let's see, we're going to need a feather. So we're going to have to find some chickens. And we're going to need an ink sack. So I'm going to have to go out into the ocean somewhere and find some some, uh, some ink sacks. 
Uh, but aside from, that shouldn't be too hard, I don't think. So I'm going to run around and do that, and I'll be back with you guys in a second. You little bugger. I have been looking for this guy for so long. Oh, boy. I can't just, I can't leave him. I gotta take him with me. I can't kill him, because apparently there's only one chicken in the entire world. And I need him. <laughs> I can't, I don't, I don't know what to do. There don't seem to be any other chickens within, like, 300 blocks on this half of the house. Like, the house should be that way. And I, I, I went, started going out that way and then curved all the way around to get to here. Come on, chicken. Okay, in the water was a bad idea. Get back on land. And you are so slow. Okay, well, I'm going to bring this guy back home because I desperately need chickens. <laughs> um, but this is good because with him around, I'll be able to get some, um, some high cow. I'll be able to get, that's oil, by the way, in the middle of the field. Um, I'll be able to get eggs, which are alright for Thomcraft stuff. They have a lot of, um, the change one. So, the change aspect. So, uh, that's nice. But, oh, am I going to have to go through water here? I think I am. There should be one river between us. But, oh boy, that's a long river. Or wide river, or something. I don't know. Maybe we're even on the... <laughs> Are we even on the on the other side? No, chicken, come here. Okay, well, I'm going to get this guy back. If he's going to follow me. And, uh... And then I'll see you guys there. Oh, of course. I turned around. I left the little chicken over there. I turned around and here's, like, ten chickens. Just all waiting for me. Okay, guys, come on. I, I'm going to get these guys over there. And... <sighs> okay. Whew! Alrighty. Got the chickens in the pen, made some babies, killed one so I could get these scribing tools. And I added, I, I changed up the floor a little bit in here because I think once I get my, um, my, my work table, like the actual stone thing, I'm going to put that here so it's going to stick out a little bit. But, um, I'm going to put the research table in this corner here. It would just, actually, you know what, I can do that now. Um because the eventually the, the big stone thing is going to be like this big. And um, over in this corner, it would take up a large chunk of the left. And I don't really want that. So I figure if we put the stone thing over here, then we can put the work table up against this side. And actually, I might want to put it like this. Um, just so that there's... I could even put a chest next to it. That, that works. Um... So we just stick that on there, and ta-da! Okay, so now I've got water down here, so I can just grab it, stick it in the thing. No big deal. There's some stone down there from me messing around. What I did was I put stairs here, um, so I can actually, like, grab in. and I can grab any of these, and it'll come back. Like, if I grab that one, it'll come back. This is just a solid 3x3 three three of water. Um, so, okay, and I've got some paper here. Not a whole lot, but some. <laughs> um... And, uh, and we can start going. So, I think I'm just going to research one thing for now. And I have a feeling I know what, it, what it's going to be. But... Unknown theory. Great. Uh, let's see. There should be some of this in there. Yes, and do I have any lapis? I don't think I do. I don't know if I want to waste gold on it. Well, I might as well. It'll allow me to make more gold after... Oh, of course it doesn't. Of course it doesn't. <laughs> Why would it? Okay, let's try... If I can get these out of it... There we go. Okay. Because I'm not really going to need gold for a while. But that will allow me to make more gold in the future, so... There's always that. Um, but for now... I think I'm going to call that an end of the episode. Um, I, I don't think there's anything else I wanted to do. 
I've got that. Stomp Stompcraft room is up and going. I've got my crucible here. I like I like this because I needed something that I could walk over without um, falling in, <laughs> and I wanted to be able to access water. And I was like, well, I could put it in like a corner or something, but that would just be weird. Um, so I ended up just putting it in the floor, and I figured this would have automatically connected if these were solid blocks. So I had to put something like stairs in, and since I couldn't get them to face that way, like you notice how there's this gap here that I could like punch through or or even grab water through. Um, I kind of didn't want that to be there, but you know what? I don't care. It just means that I can grab it from I can grab water from more angles. If I'm over here, I can grab water, no problem. Um, so if I'm at my table, I can just turn around, grab water, put it in the crucible, whatever. And I've actually, this whole place, there's no torches on the floor. So, um, when I accidentally go and do this, <laughs> there's no big deal. Um, so that's pretty cool. Um, let's see, on my, on my way over, I, I found several, oh, an alarm going off. Um, I found several trees, like the big, um, the big, Great wood trees with with the chests under them, and I got a I got a thom craft. I got another thomium axe. I got some more you know various materials, and um, I believe I got. Let's see, I, I know I picked up a silverwood tree, and so I have a silverwood sapling here, um, and this is like my thom craft thing <laughs> where I put all my thom craft stuff. Like I I don't think this is actually thom craft related, but I use it for the crystal aspect and nothing else, so I figured that would be a good place to put it. But, uh, yeah. So I'm just gonna call it an end here, and have I been recording for an hour? Oh, no, I've been playing for an hour. I haven't been recording the whole time, right? Hopefully it's not I've been recording for an hour. Jeez. All right. Uh, um, next time we will start, like, getting more research done. I'll have more paper by then, so um, we should be a bit better on that. But yeah, thanks for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye!